Hi, and welcome to CVS Health Live, our ongoing series that delivers timely perspectives and relevant insights into healthcare issues that are happening right now. I'm Jessica DeMassa, and today we are going inside the business of CVS Health. We have a very exciting one-on-one -on -one chat planned for you with the Chief Customer Officer of CVS Health, Michelle Peluzzo. Now, Michelle is going to talk through all the exciting things that are happening at CVS Health its evolution as a company, its new purpose, its new campaign called Healthier Happens Together. And then we're going to talk a little bit about some of the things that she sees in store for us in the future. So without further ado, please join me in welcoming the Executive Vice President and Chief Customer Officer of CVS Health, Michelle Peluzzo. Thanks, Jess. Thrilled to be here as well. What an important and exciting time in healthcare. Oh my God, there is so much going on. And so thank you so much for taking the time to get us caught up on what is happening at CVS Health because we've been covering a lot of the things that you've been working on over the years, but um, haven't really heard much about strategically what you guys are thinking looking forward. So why don't you get us all up to speed? Because I'm sure not many in our audience realize the full breadth and depth of services that CVS Health provides, including some of the things that come along with the 2018 acquisition of Aetna. So why don't you level set for us, Michelle, and explain um, CVS Health like as it stands today. What are the, the breadth and depth of services that you offer? Well, what's so exciting about CVS Health is we are truly sort of America's health solutions company. And when you think about it, we have the ability to pay and finance care with Aetna, of course, with Caremark, the ability to provide care. We have over 40,000 people uh, who provide care, nurse practitioners, doctors, et cetera, pharmacists across the company. And of course, we engage with customers every single day in their healthcare moments, whether that's them walking into a CVS Health or, of course, pharmacy, et cetera. What is truly remarkable to me, though, is just what happened over the course of the pandemic. When you think about the past two years, there's fundamental shifts in healthcare happening. And you know this so well, Jess, but really two things I would say simultaneously. First, consumer needs have changed. Their demands on healthcare have never been higher. They want to be in control. They want healthcare that's accessible, convenient. Um, you know, they want to be able to have hybrid options. So they are increasingly putting themselves in the driver's seat. But secondly, of course, we had to shift and adapt and use technology in really new ways. Um, an amazing example of that is what happened over COVID with testing and vaccines. Digitally, seamlessly enabling tens of millions of Americans to get tested, to get their vaccines. And of course, the in-store experience, which provided you know, the incredible uh, capability to actually deliver those vaccines. So when you think about it, uh, CVS Health is so involved in so many aspects of true healthcare really being a consumer-centered company focused on providing the best possible health care for, for Americans. All right, so I understand that you actually started in this in this period of time that, that, that coincided with COVID-19 and all of the work that has been going on there. Say a little bit more, Michelle, if you can, about some of the trends that you've noticed, you know, in your role, particularly in this time frame. I think you've touched on them quite a bit in terms of how they've shaped you know, strategically the direction that CVS Health has taken and the focus that you guys have had over the last you know, two, almost two years now. But I mean, you, for you specifically, you know, how do you think that COVID-19 has changed healthcare in your role? Yeah, it's a great question. And, and the thing that's really um, incredible to me is I've had the opportunity to watch several industries and participate in several industries taking advantage of digital and taking advantage of increasing customer demands to change the industry that happened in, in travel, that happened in financial services, that happened in retail. And we see that happening now in healthcare. When you think about the consumer, she is more in charge of her healthcare needs than ever before. And yet she needs a partner. She doesn't think it's easy to keep her, her family, the people she cares for healthy. And you know, when you think about what COVID did, it really put her even more fundamentally in the driver's seat and it changed the way technology and healthcare kind of interrelated. So we could never have vaccinated tens of millions of people as we've done at CVS Health if there weren't that interplay between digital and physical. Digitally scheduling, getting your reminders, and then of course showing up at the store to have your COVID vaccine administered or your COVID test administered. It's a great example of consumer in charge on her terms 
you know, and, and she's in control and a really amazing interplay between digital and physical. I love the use of that feminine pronoun there, calling to the fact that a lot of um, the healthcare decisions are made by women. I think that's awesome, Michelle. I love it. All right. I want to ask you um, specifically about something that happened earlier this year. Coming out of the CEO's office, Karen Lynch announced that there's a new company purpose. And this company purpose, is a, it's, it's, it's beautiful to me. We bring our heart to every moment of your health. We bring our heart to every moment of your health. What does that mean to you? And talk to us a little bit, you know, behind, take us behind the scenes on how this evolved. It's such a great statement. And um, to your point, it is truly such a great expression of what we do every day at CVS Health. So CVS Health has always been a really purpose-driven company. It's in our DNA and it's one of the many, many reasons over 300,000 people, you know, at CVS Health kind of come to work every single day. But when Karen, uh, what she did is she stepped back and she encouraged us, and I say us because it was really this incredible team effort, I'll talk about that more in a second, to think about you know coming out of the merger with Aetna, coming out of the pandemic, what was the best way to express our purpose? And so we began this incredible process. Uh, Lori Havanek, our chief HR officer, myself and others, um, we had lots of pharmacists involved, distribution colleagues, friend store colleagues, Aetna colleagues, you know, call center employees, we really galvanized this company conversation about what is at the heart of our purpose. And of course, the heart has a lot of meaning for us, given that's our logo. And so it's always been imbued with more than just sympathy. It's been imbued with innovation and kind of this, this sense of changing the face of healthcare. So bringing our heart to every moment of your health grew out of employees really thinking about when are we at our best? What is our aspiration? What is our vision? What is, what is the reason we come to work every day? Um, and really, so many of those words matter. Heart is about empathy, of course, but it's also about innovative solutions, new ideas, fresh ways of thinking. And every moment of health is really important, too, because, you know, we are, you, you know, you have episodic care with certain doctors in your life. But with CVS Health, it really is a relationship. You're coming in frequently. You have the pharmacist relationship. Maybe you're using the Minute Clinic. You're at, maybe Aetna is and Caremark are the ones who are sort of helping you to finance your health care. So, it is one of those things that we think about the word every and moment as being really particularly important for us. Michelle, I love hearing about this. We bring our heart to every moment of your health. And then I understand that Healthier Happens Together is this creative platform that really expands on that message. So let's take a look at a quick video. And then on the other side, I want you to unpack all of this and bridge the connections for us. Let's roll the video. When you hear the word healthy, it always feels a little out of reach. That's because the way we're thinking about it is all wrong. So we made a healthier song. For some folks, it's like baby steps. Maybe it's a jump or eating something green or taking mom to get that vaccine. Healthier means bringing stuff to the folks that really need it. Like Millie's Med, straight to her door. Just give people access for Bob and men admitting that he needed reading glasses. Healthier comes in all these different shapes and sizes and ages and races and faces and sizes. Come for the all means we're doing healthier right. So let's do it all together, people. Cause this is what healthier looks like. All right, Michelle. So that was Awesome. I love seeing that. Very lively and very spirited. And I think the message is, you know, one that we can all really find very appealing because health is different for everybody, but we all need to, to work together to help each other achieve health. So, I mean, why was this the right moment for CVS Health to, to launch Healthier Happens Together? It's a super exciting moment for us and it expresses the company's purpose and brings to life the company's purpose in a unique way. And first of all, I would say it was grounded in research. We've been doing a lot of research, especially over the past year and a half, about what does it take for people, you know, to, as they think about their health, what is front and center? And what we found is that almost universally, people want to live healthier lives. There's no doubt in survey after survey, people want to live healthier lives. But there's also no doubt that they feel like it's hard. They feel overwhelmed. You know, they're turning to Dr. Google. I think I heard a statistic that there are something like 70 million searches every minute on healthcare related issues. So they want to be in control, but it feels overwhelming. There's this real passion for being healthier. There's this real sense of it is difficult and challenging. But the hope and the silver lining in a lot of the research was this idea that, you know, together, 
with the right partners, using digital technology, uh, thinking differently about the decisions you make, you know, that healthier is possible. The second thing is we really wanted this to represent the sort of hopeful moment for America and the inclusive America that we see. And that's one of the incredible benefits that we have of being in almost every community in America. You know, I think our stores are 85% of our Americans live within 10 miles of our store. So we get to see all slices of healthcare from just the, you know, mom running in every day for, for basic things like vitamins or Neosporin or, you know, things to, to take care of, to chronic conditions, to home care. You know, we, we are in homes helping with kidney care, managing chronic conditions. So we have this wide spectrum in terms of how we participate in so many Americans' lives. And we have over 100 million, I think, American customers that we serve. So it is a pretty incredible thing to represent the beauty of that and the optimism that we believe with Healthier Happens Together. What do you hope that people will take away, for, you know, as far as a message from Healthier Happens Together? And I mean, I think also coupled with that beautiful new company purpose. Yeah, that's a great question. And they really are synergistic. That's the beauty of it. Um, I think what we would love for people to take away, first of all, is that, you know, we are truly here as a partner in health and healthier. Um, you know, and that can take a lot of forms. We have really incredible, innovative digital solutions. We have, you know, 40 plus thousand care providers that are, that are in communities to help you, you know, even with your advanced chronic conditions. We serve in the home, we serve in physical stores, we serve kind of digitally. So, um, you know, this, this, uh, this aspect of CVS Health that, that so few people know, the breadth and depth of our services, and of course, our passion for putting our heart, you know, in every moment of your health. So I think that's the real takeaway. This this company that has emerged to be a true healthcare solutions company um, that so many can count on in their path to healthier. All right, as we wrap things up here, Michelle, um, tell me what role you're most excited to see, to see CVS Health play in the future. Well, I'm passionate about customer centricity and I'm passionate about digital. So to me, and Jess, you know this so well, there's so many incredible emerging capabilities that can help people on their path to better health. And that's what has me incredibly excited. You know, when you look at the acceleration of things like telehealth, um, when you look at, you know, the acceleration of ways that you can manage chronic conditions using diagnostics, at-home devices, monitoring and the like, I think it's an exciting time where consumers can be in charge of their healthcare decisions and, and getting healthier and relying on partners like CVS and new technology to make that possibility a reality. So I'm I'm excited about all that's ahead. And when I look to the future, I see, you know, that I see CVS Health is really a unique company in terms of our passion for putting the consumer in the driver's seat of healthcare and making healthcare more convenient, accessible, and affordable for all. So it's a it's a very dynamic time. Um, and the pa pandemic certainly accelerated our need. Uh, to, to be agile and to adjust. But I think it's also a great time for consumers as healthcare transforms to be more consumer centric and of course, to be more technology led. All right, well, that is very exciting. Michelle, thank you so much for stopping by and getting us up to speed on the evolution of CVS Health itself. I mean, it's really exciting to hear a little bit about the strategy behind what we see and experience as consumers. So thank you so much for joining us here today and for, for sharing with us Healthier Happens Together and the, some of the rationale behind it and what you guys hope it will mean for healthcare um, consumers and patients and people in the future. Thanks so much, Jess. A pleasure to spend time with you. All right, Michelle, thank you again for joining us. Everybody, that was Michelle Paluzzo. She is the Executive Vice President and Chief Customer Officer at CVS Health. For more information on everything we discussed here today, the company purpose, Healthier Happens Together, if you want to take another look at that video, please check out the URL below. We'll see you on the next episode of CVS Health Live. I'm Jessica Damasa. Thanks for joining us. Take care.